All right, here it is. Now hold it together because you got two bolts that hold it together. Do not. Let that pop because this is spring loaded. Get both of them out. Now you can ease it apart. You'll see the oil come out. And there's the cap. There's the front. You got a spring and you got a cap then you got the shaft seem to always get the shaft for some reason and you got another spring and another spring And a cap. I'm doing this in the truck because you're not allowed to smoke in the hotel. All right, right here is a piece. There is a spring in here. Do not lose that spring. So you pop this out. I don't know what I did with that screwdriver I had yesterday when I took this apart. But let's see if I can do this without letting that spring. Is it out? It's I don't out. Really see the spring. Yeah, there's the spring. Okay, there's the spring. There it goes in there. And that spring comes out of there. That's a itty bitty little bastard. That gets away from you, you're fucked. And then this is your diaphragm. This right here is what seals, what separates this into two chambers. This diaphragm right here. Now let's see what's wrong with the diaphragm. Let's go ahead and roll it out here. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Bam, there it is right there. Diaphragm has got a big hole in it, it's tore. So instead of buying a new turbo for a thousand dollars and you know however much it costs to have it put on if you're at a shop or whatever you want to do this is a fifteen dollar kit you can get this online it's fifteen dollars and it comes with your new diaphragm all your o-rings and a new gasket so you just rebuild it you put all these seals back in it you put it back together and you put it in which is what i'm going to do now and then we'll get back to you and see if this is the problem